Because you are that, you are capable. You are gifted, and you are so unique. All of the things that you may hate about yourself are your strengths. It's okay to be soft. It's okay to be opinionated. It's okay to be different. And it's so okay to just be The world awaits to receive you. Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular the man. Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular the man. Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular the man. Now you know I was gonna do it because I know that's annoying for some people, and I love it. Yes, I'm back. Happy New Year. Yes, you're here with Grace Levi coming in differently, different, differently different this new year. Yes, I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited as well. Um, I know, you know, the typical making your New Year's resolution and all things like that, but that should be yearly. Stick to it. Let's get to it. So as I stick to my resolution where I'm going to keep it 100 percent uncensored with you guys, as well as hit the topics that's trending, but not just the main like mainstream. You know what I'm saying? So we got some celebrity news. We got some local updates. Yes, yes, yes. And we also got conspiracies are real yes grace levi ain't changed that much i ain't make that resolution so we're gonna do that segment as you know on rumble shout out to rumble i hope you guys are streaming i think we got everything together we had a little issue but we got it yes so now what we're gonna start with we're gonna start with hold on what we got celebrity news celebrity news let me let me get my lineup together i miss y'all I've been, I've been working like a dog. But, oh, before I start my celebrity news, I want to say, I got to say this. I want to send a shout out to my baby girl. Yes, this is what I've been working on. My baby girl has started officially college, okay? She's living on campus. She done moved out of her house. You know, I homeschooled for a lot of years. So this is a big transition for us. So that's some of the things that I was handling. But I'm grateful because guess what? She's going to grow into a beautiful young lady. And guess what? I need a break. Okay. Anyway, but I want to say, um, I do want to say to her when she watched this, because I, I, you know, she, I do prompt her to watch some of my shows. Okay. Um, I love you. I wish you the best. And no matter what, you know, I got your back. Okay. Stay focused and stay sucker free. You already know. Keep your eyes on the books and stay on point. You know what mama said. You know what mama see? Your mama said, shine a light on the world. And she said, I'll be trolling. My baby girl said, I'll be trolling. I don't be trolling. Okay, let's get to it. I love you and good luck in all of your studies. You know, I'll be popping up on that ass. You know what I do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How you gonna be stalking your daughter? Like, what you doing, girl? But one of the first topics we wanna get to, we just gonna address is um one of our focus topics. On YouTube, as well as Rumble, we have been um, releasing a series of some of the um, talks we have on the YSL trial. So we already know this is where we are right now. The YSL trial resumes after the defendant was stabbed in Fulton County Jail. Um, um, while I'm releasing the series, like, you know, just basically the flashbacks, the highlights of YSL, I'm going to be highlighting all of the local news that I have been highlighting about Fulton County Jail, okay, about the conditions, about how many inmates have died, and also Clayton County. So you're going to see that in the series of videos that come out. I did release one, and it kind of had a good, you know, hit the algorithm, okay? So I appreciate that. Please hit the like button, because you know I'm going to hit you with something differently different, okay? Now, let's play this real quick, see where we at, and then I'm just going to give you a little commentary, because we're going to do a focus live on this. Because, you know, they've been going in. And, Jack, I'm already talking about it. I've been watching it. Me and my son been analyzing the trial and stuff like that. But let me let this play real quick. Morning. 
Nearly a year after jury selection for the racketeering conspiracy trial for rapper Young Thug started, that trial is set to get back underway today. It's scheduled to resume after it was paused in December. You'll remember it took 10 months to even seat a jury with deliberations only getting started November 27th. The trial only made it 12 days before a defendant in the case was stabbed by another inmate inside the Fulton County Jail. And okay, now, <laughs> Fulton County Jail is dangerously dangerous. Um, you know that your YSL is not in there, thank God, you know, because he may not be um, in good condition being in there or possibly survive because you see what's happening. And before I go on, I want to highlight this guys, because if you have people that's in prison, you may want to write to the prison. And I'm not saying that these people in the prison don't deserve what they get. But like I said, if they not dead, if they didn't get death, they shouldn't be dead. And we should have a rehabilitation center. But one of the issues that I found here in Fulton County and all of these County, they're mixing inmates. Now that gang violence has spread across the whole United States, because it was, it was just more in urban neighborhoods, but every t now that more places that had been known as being suburbs, more country is turning into, you know, the hood or what they call non-suburb areas, the gangs are there. So I need you guys to be prepared. But so what's going on in the jails is specifically the jails don't know how to separate these inmates. And I, this is what I think happened with YSL um, co-defending. If you have a bunch of different gangs together in one pot, it's, it's common sense that something is going to happen. So what they do in Jersey, they have gang units, okay? And it's not to have them go in there and conjugate and come up with more crime, but it does stop the violence inside. Also, Fulton County is so destroyed that these inmates are taking pieces of the, the jail, like the metal out of the wall, and making swords, Okay, we're going to share more with you later on when we get into local news. Okay, it is off the hook. So I just wanted to remind you guys that I am focused on the YSL trial and there is going to be a re release of flashbacks this week. And I believe this weekend I'll be able to go over a review of what's going on in the court with um, allegedly one of the top, um, how do they say, creators or the... Um, leaders of YSL is being actually cross, not cross-examined, but put out as a witness. And <clears throat> baby, I'm going to say that that guy is not as dumb as people saying that he is. And we're just going to say that. Hold on one. <laughs>